Griffith University is one of Australia's leading research universities based in southeast Queensland on the East Australian coast. The research we're conducting aims to better understand the world, improve people's lives and make a real impact on society. My name is Dr Nicholas West and I'm a research scientist in the Mucosal Immunology Research Group at Griffith University. Challenges in relation to the heterogeneity of immune activity, the location and types of cells that we're seeing at diseased areas and the complexity of transcriptional and translational processes continue to limit our understanding of the biological drivers of disease. My name is Marshall Fetrell. I'm the Technical Sales Specialist for the Asia Pacific region. My role encompasses uh, providing customer awareness and education on our spatial biology platform, the Geomix Digital Spatial Profiler. I also help answer any technical questions and help with project design uh, for our customers. Geomix uh, technology is quite interesting. So one of the challenges that researchers face is having to choose between high expression profiling or doing spatial context. So you get high-plex multi-parameter analysis within a spatial context that's both quantitative and precise. Spatial biology is cutting edge technology that allows for the measurement and mapping of the spatial distribution of proteins and RNA in a tissue sample. Our current methods that rely on the bulk extraction of cells and mRNA results in the loss of this spatial distribution and spatial information of the molecular drivers of disease. Spatial biology allows for the comprehensive assessment of cells and molecules within their morphological context. This has led to important discoveries for defining tissue pathology and to gain insight into disease etiology, disease progression and disease resolution. The Geomix DSP is the only spatial platform on the market that's able to interrogate both RNA and protein uh, in FFPE tissue blocks in a very sensitive and specific manner. So on the RNA side of things, uh, with our detection chemistry, we don't use a poly A capture grab. Our probes tile along the most stable portions of an RNA transcript. And because of that, we're able to detect uh, RNA um, in these tissue types in a very sensitive way. The Jamix platform allows us to examine images of tissue at really high resolution. Being able to map RNA and protein to their exact morphological context is a really exciting component of the Jamix platform. The workflow of the Geomix DSP is very similar to an IHC protocol. So for researchers who are familiar with IHC or aminofluorescence histochemistry, they'll be able to easily adopt the Geomix workflow. The Jamix DSP workflow is relatively straightforward. Like all immunophenotyping technologies, there are a number of nuances and complexities, but certainly it's straightforward and easy to use. There is no technology that allows us to do high-plex, high-dimensional profiling like the Geomix platform. Compared to IHC or flow cytometry, the workflow process for the Geomix is straightforward and provides us with unprecedented amount of data for us to understand the biological processes driving disease. As an Anastring Centre of Excellence, the Systems Biology and Data Science Shared Research Facility at Griffith University is open for service and research collaborations, not only in Australia and New Zealand, but also across the Asia Pacific. Nanostring's role in spatial biology is to allow researchers and clinicians to phenotypically profile cells in a morphological context. With our unique imaging and profiling technology, we're able to outline non-contiguous regions within a tissue sample, and that allows us to profile across separate tissue microenvironments. We have a well-trained research team to provide high-quality service in geomic spatial profiling, but also across bioinformatics and data science. We're also excited to be able to apply the geomics technology to mucosal immunology to better understand diseases like respiratory illness, oncology, metabolic disease, and type 2 inflammatory diseases. As a nanostring centre of excellence, the Systems Biology and Data Science Shared Research Facility will provide the scientific community in Australia and across the Asia-Pacific with the latest in the innovative immune profiling techniques. Given our strong links with the Nanostring team, we offer efficient, comprehensive and tailored opportunities to generate high impact research outcomes.